What's happening, man? It's your boy Papa Duck back with another video. Some crazy, crazy, crazy things that happened today. Um, if you're on uh, YouTube, make sure you subscribe to the channel, man. Make sure you hit that like button. And also, look below, you'll see all our merch. Everything you get off our merchandise store, all proceeds goes back to the channel. And also, if you want to promote on this channel, go to PapaDuckPromo at gmail.com and we get it going. I don't know if y'all noticed today they had another school shooting in Oxford, uh, Oxford High School is in Michigan. And uh, it's reported that three are dead, six are wounded. Uh, one of the wounded is a, t a school teacher, um, a 15-year-old um, white kid um, that was taken in with a handgun. Crazy part is they said he, he, he didn't answer no questions. The only thing he said was he wanted his lawyer. Kind of sound like some plotted shit to me or whatever the case may be. But my thing is this. Um, I just think it's something really, really behind all these school shootings, man. It's something really, really behind. And I know a lot of times when they want to implement things, they give you the problem. And then they'll rush in with the, well, they give you the problem. Then they study the problem. Then they give you the the, um, the solution. And, um... A lot of things I may say or speak on, it may be too far for a lot of people to grasp. You know what I'm saying? Um, I know definitely social media got a lot to do with a lot of the things that teens do. Uh, teen suicide rate is through the roof due to um, uh, social media. It's a different world out there. You know what I'm saying? And um, I wouldn't want nobody to get hurt, especially going to school. Or whatever case, I don't really care for school anyway because I know what school is. But for those who don't, you know, want their kids to go to school, I don't want your kids to be hurt or nothing like that. Especially from no shooting like this. This is crazy. And this shit happens so often to it's kind of like, oh, okay, another school shooting. But it's always somebody whose um, family is going to be crying behind these incidents. And this shit is getting out of hand. I mean... I would hate to say, you know, metal detectors in schools, but they got them in the airports. You don't see, you don't hear about people getting shot on airplanes like that. You know, they, 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 shit, they got them in the wrong place. But like I say, um, these big businesses protect what, what feeds them. Like a lot of the stuff we go through in life, they don't give a flying damn. You know what I'm saying? They can care less of a damn about certain things unless it's um, actually feeding them. But uh, again, there's a lot can be done about this. I know a lot of people gonna have a lot of different things to say about it, but it's just crazy, man. All these damn school shootings. What the hell are these kids thinking about, man? Like, what the hell going on? I really don't have no no solution to that myself. But like I say, I don't. The only reason why for y'all that may say why I say it, I don't care for school because I understand school is just. A, 12-step brainwash camp, you know what I'm saying? We, they only make us go to school by law so that we can furthermore be controlled later on in life. So just imagine somebody born and don't know nothing. It's hard to control a person that knows how to, don't know how to read, write, don't know nothing, just airheaded all the way around, never been to school, wasn't taught to be civilized. So they at least got to go ahead and give you some type of dumbing down in order to control us. So, But uh, outside of that, you know, a lot of these school shootings don't get the proper press it should get as opposed to R. Kelly pissing, R. Kelly pissing on somebody. Or just, you know, they just they, they choose to put it out there in the news what they want. You know what I'm saying? And um, sometimes, man, when you feed a society bullshit or you raise them to be a certain type of person or you've instilled that negative energy in them, it turns around and bites you in the ass. You get what I'm saying? So, like, when you look at certain people that's in the world, whether he's a killer, whether he's steal, whatever it is they do, sometimes society uh, will grow these people to become that. I know some of y'all may disagree, but it's just the truth. You know what I'm saying? If, uh, like I always tell y'all, if they wanted the world to be a better place, it would be. You know, you got laws on certain shit, just like I did a video yesterday. They make up laws on some of the stupidest shit in the world. I mean, things that, um, like, they, I just saw where they trying to stop uh, 
people for selling food, like pop-up shops, like, you know, like uh, food carts and they trying to stop them from popping up selling food. Like, what kind of shit is this? Like, just stupid stuff. Stuff that really don't, really is not going to change society in no type of way. You're still going to have school shootings. Like, shit that they need to focus on, they don't. Because like I tell y'all, if you don't pay them, they don't give a damn. You know what I'm saying? They put the right people in, 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 in um as a city commissioner. They put the right people in position so that they can vote certain things in and out. A lot of times y'all being small cities and wonder why certain restaurants don't come to that city is because it's politics. I'm from a city where they say, oh, Checkers supposed to came up years ago. Or this supposed to came up years ago. They're not going to let it happen because there are certain restaurant owners, whether it's a Taco Bell, whether it's a McDonald's, whatever it is, they have a political uh, agenda and they're tied in with those who can make that possible. So a lot of stuff that don't come to your city be through politics. So this is why I say in order for people to become better people, we have to ourselves solve our own problems. Half the people that try to solve problems for us don't come where we come from, don't look like us, don't know what we go through. You know what I'm saying? How the fuck can, how the fuck can, can, can any Clinton, well, you could, let's say George Clinton. George Clinton said, they, 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 you know how when you walk in the store and you hit a little, the little ding dong bell. They said what that was. He didn't know what it was. Anybody that ever went into a shopping center or a grocery store Heard that ding don't they know what it is. He didn't know what it was. Why? Because he said he never been in the grocery store. He never had to go shop for himself. He never had to. How the fuck can people like that govern us? People that don't 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 that's another video. I'm gonna do a whole nother video on that. I'm gonna do a whole nother video on that. But man. Like I say, man, in Oxford High School in Michigan, they had a shooting today. Three deceased. I think it was six wounded, including the school teacher. And all I'm saying is, man, this shit is crazy. It's, and it's going to get worse because, like, I keep trying to tell people, you can't put people that don't give a fuck about you in a position to govern you, to make laws for you. The crazy part is you can be working in that school and know exactly what's going on, but you got to go through all this red tape to get to people who don't see what's going on, don't give a fuck what's going on. You got to go through them to get to say so on what it is that you're actually, like you in the midst of the storm. That blows my mind. <laughs> That's why I say people will never get it. We'll never get it. It's sad, but people just ain't gonna never get it. Anyway, man, I just wanted to run that to y'all, man. Y'all may or may not have seen that, man. Put how you feel on the bottom of the um of the, of the video, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all may, I, I, like I said, I'm, I'm right now. I don't really know. You know, I just feel like there's some behind all this, and it's gonna come out. So put how you feel on the bottom of here, man. You know what I'm saying? We all read comments. We all make and come to, you know, some type of conclusion on what the fuck going on. But it's just crazy, man, all these school shootings, man. And um, I know one thing is us putting all this power in these kids' hand to the point where kids know we can't touch them or they feel as though we can't we can't whoop them, we can't do shit. They got more power over the, over the mothers and fathers and teachers and, adult, like, they can do what the hell they want to do. In their mind, nothing's going to happen. And you got to think about it. You can't put an undeveloped mind in that perspective of they can and can't do something, especially something like that. So with an undeveloped mind, get the notion that, hey, I could do this and all I got to do is, you know, and ain't going to, you know, all kind of shit going to happen. Anyway, man, it's your boy Papa Dog. Y'all already know what time it is, man. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you ain't. And like I always tell y'all, in order for you to be found, you must first be lost. I'm out.